hello everyone and welcome to today's video in today's video we are going to unbox this mystery box that i purchased on black friday from trend mood and i paid 39 dollars for it and i'm so excited to see what's in it so let's open it together all right here we go. Let's open this. Here we go. Okay, so it seems like they are reusing some of their old uh, boxes. So that's cool. And this one is from Glow Skin Beauty. Give yourself care, Rachel, professional upgrade. Okay, are you guys ready? I really have no expectation. I have no idea what could be in here. I mean, the price wasn't that much, so I'm not sure what to expect, you know, but it's supposed to get over $150 worth of products, so we'll see if I have any of these products already in my um, collection, if I like anything, we shall see, but don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this, and also don't forget to subscribe and comment down below. Uh, what mystery box would you be interested to see next? Now, let's see. Let's see what it is in here. Okay, so I see an eyeshadow palette. Oh, this is the Nabla one? What? Okay, there's things stuck to the bottom of it. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Things stuck to the bottom of it. But there is an eyeshadow palette. I don't have this one. I do have a Nabla palette, but it's not this one. Let me take this one out. Okay, so I took it out from the package. This is the side-by-side -side one, and it looks really pretty. Look at that. Ooh, I like that. So pretty. I'm happy about this eyeshadow palette. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. I think this one is as much as it has much as I paid for this box so that's a good thing or it's cheaper I'm not sure but next thing in here we have the glow skin beauty bio renew EGF drops epidermal growth factor coal repairing serum oh that's gonna be good I love serums I love any repairing serums it's gonna help with any of the redness any of those really bad acne scars and stuff like that so i'm excited to have this in my collection i'm gonna give it a try and see how that's gonna go so good a serum Ooh, that's good okay next in here we have abh dewy set setting spray never had this one i never tried a setting spray from abh so that's gonna be interesting is this like a pineapple? It has pineapples on it. So, hmm, interesting. Okay, let's see what else in here. Ooh, the NYX Marshmallow Primer. Actually, it was interesting in getting this one. I wasn't sure if I want to, but I heard a lot of people talking about this one, and they talk a, little, a lot of good things about it. I mean, I know a couple of YouTubers that says that this is their favorite uh, primer, so... I don't know. I'm going to give it a try and see how that's going to be. But yeah, we got the primer from NYX. Okie dokie. Now next in here, we have the Booster Drops Hydrating uh, Elf Oil. I had these before. Um, it's a nice one. Unfortunately, I have a lot of skincare right now. And I'm not incorporating oils that much anymore. But I'm going to try to give it a go. We'll see how I can make it fit in my uh, skincare routine. But nevertheless, this is a good product. And this is around 10 bucks. I think that that's, that's all that, that is. All right, next in here. Oh, I have another elf thing. Okay, so this is Lash It Loud uh, Voluminizing Mascara in Black. Oh, I have so many mascaras right now that I need to try that I 
don't even know when I'm going to get around to try this one. So it says the brush tip amps up even the smallest lashes. Okay, so volume that hits all the high notes. I might just give it a try in one of the short videos just to kind of see how it is. Because I'm really looking for a very good voluminizing one. I do have one that I really love, but I'm looking for maybe... A cheaper version than the one that I really like so this one might be it I'm gonna give it a try and see how that is and then the last thing in here I see we have something from Dominique Cosmetics and I think this is a lipstick and the color seems to be nude co co cocoa nude cocoa okay well, let me take it out so I can see how that looks okay so this is how this one looks like I did the uh, Put it on my hand right here just to kind of see how the color is a little bit dark i would say but sometimes i do wear colors like this ones i never tried anything uh i've never tried any lipsticks from dominic cosmetics i did try her uh eyeshadows and i really do like that so i'm excited to try her lipstick as well bullet lipstick now let me see what do you guys think about what we got let me put them back in so we can talk about it okay so what do you guys think about what we got so i am a little bit intrigued i do have like a couple of them that are like this one is drugstore this one is drugstore this one is drugstore and then we have um four that are not so I mean, there's a lot of products in here for $39. I gotta say, I'm not mad at it. But is it the best decision of investing my money in this um, mystery box? I don't know. I always love mystery boxes. I love, I enjoy them. So I do like what I got. We'll see how they're gonna be in the next videos. And um, let me know what you got in yours. Did you got this box? And what did you receive? Is it the same thing or something different? Let me know down below. Thank you so much for watching. And I cannot wait to see you all next time. Bye now.